What is up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, hi, my name is Libby. I know I usually don't start vlogs like this, but I wanted to actually say hi and let you know what I want to do in this vlog. Today is Monday, May 1st, and I'm wanting to take you guys through a workout with me. I am starting the last and final week. This is an eight week program, so I thought it would be fun to take you guys with me for a little leg day today. I know we all love leg day, but we're gonna hit glutes and hams today, and otherwise I just wanted to bring you along with me. So this is like a very small snippet of what my week of workouts videos would be. It's more so just a day in my life and bringing you with me to the gym but having a more in-depth talk and chit chat about the gym. First things first, I already had my coffee today. Alani launched a brand new protein coffee as well so I've had both of those today. It's a salted caramel flavor and it's so good. I love it. You guys can always use code Libby if you want to shop Alani. I am picking out my gym outfit and in my last video I think I showed you guys the new legacy shorts that came out. This is such a bright beautiful color. It's the same legacy shorts that we all know and love. They did release new colors but they haven't had brand new colors kind of like these ones so this this is the blue one and she's super cute has little drawstring cords on the side so you can scrunch it if you want it's also a matching minimal bra for this I don't have that because I don't wear them they just don't work so well for me I have this bandeau that I think will look cute with it so I already have my food my breakfast I got a mini hard-boiled egg maker you guys and it's so cute and I love it because it cooks eggs perfectly in no time let's get dressed and let's get ready. This is what we're working with. Cutie, they are short, but I love them. And then you can scrunch the sides here. Stop, stop, stop. Hold over the waistband because my torso is so short. And then this is the training bandeau. And this is one of the newer colors, but I just strapped it over my head and loosened it. So now, a little crisscross moment going on. I have to decide on my shoes. I feel like I might just go with white. I feel like that's always the best call. And also we're doing legs today. Even though my Metcons are disgusting, they're just so nasty. I should really wash them, but I haven't yet because I'm a little bit scared. The APLs, they wash so easily and I feel like that's why I really like them as well. Not only are they a really comfy and light shoe and they're all white, but they wash so easily. I just throw them into the washer. I have to decide shoes and then we will head out. This is the Alani protein coffee that just dropped today. I think that it'll be in stores eventually if you guys wanna grab it there. This is the salted caramel flavor. I have to say this is one of my top faves because I don't love chocolate. So this is delightful. I love caramel. I say caramel. Do you guys say caramel? I don't say caramel. Thing about these is that they're so smooth when you drink them. Like it's not a thick protein shake type of vibe. It's like smooth, like a little coffee. Like it tastes like my Nespresso coffee, honestly. So I love her. We love Alani in this house. I'm gonna have my greens as well because I haven't had them yet today. Even though I've already eaten and everything, I had a cup of coffee this morning already. Darren is getting up. He's getting ready. We have week eight, day one literally the last week of my program then i feel like we could go back and do the intermediate one of the same program or the beginner one that's what's so lovely about this is that there's so many options for you and then the alive app also has a million and six other programs or challenges or workouts that you guys can follow too if you're ever just running out of ideas for yourself it's a good little source a resource all right you guys i'm going to take you through a leg day with me i did bring the boys with me today but this is just me setting up i am so excited to share this with you because it has been such a hot minute since i've posted a week of workouts but we're going to get warmed up starting with some dynamic stretching super cool about this is that i get to take you guys through a leg day with me on the alive app in my lift program so if you guys don't know i am on alive and you guys can do a seven day free trial just to see if alive is right for you but you also get just a gist of what this program is we have different warm warm-ups and cool downs provided with this workout so you'll have some before warm-ups and after cool downs and right now we're going to do some dynamic warm-ups meaning that our body is in motion we're kind of warming up those muscles and heating ourselves up to prepare for our first lift in this program we're working on hypertrophy and progressive overload meaning that we're going to add weight or time under tension as time goes on here we're starting with four sets of five barbell back squats you can see that my body mechanics might be a little different than yours which is totally okay that's just the way our bodies are making sure that we're taking things slow really focused focusing on form and also hitting that parallel point before coming back up. But before the next exercise, let's have a word from our sponsor. I am so excited to let you guys know that this video is sponsored by Native. I am such a big fan of their body washes. I buy them every single time that I go to the store and I have a, quite the collection going on under our bathroom sink. I've exclusively been buying Native body wash for probably a year now and JJ and I both love it. He loves being surprised with the new scent every time we run 
run out of a bottle. I've been on the search for cleaner and more simple ingredients that nourish my skin and leave me feeling super fresh. I find that Native doesn't leave any residue on my skin, especially when getting out of the shower after a hot and sweaty workout. I keep a good stock of Native for our bathroom and also the guest bathrooms, and I always get compliments on not only the lather, but the scents as well. The scents that I chose this time around are sandalwood and shea butter, aloe and green tea, sweet cinnamon hearts from the candy shop, and cucumber and mint. That doesn't even include all the ones that I keep on hand, like sweet peach and nectar, citrus and herbal musk, and eucalyptus and mint. I also have empties of those as well because we're just a native body wash household at this point. I always feel silky smooth and I smell amazing for the entire day. Native has clean, simple ingredients that are easy to understand and they're all naturally derived ingredients to cleanse your skin. They're also cruelty-free and vegan. As you can see, there's such a variety of scent options that you can choose from with new ones being released all the time. Whether you want to smell spicy and woodsy or clean and crisp, there's an option for everybody. You can use my code Christensen2 to get 20% off of your first purchase at Native. This offer is available site-wide, but only for a limited time, so make sure you stock up and save. Thank you again to Native for sponsoring this video. Not a Livy leg day without some RDLs. I love these because they're super special, three second eccentric barbell RDLs. So you're going to be counting one, two, and three on the way down and coming straight back up, and then going one, two, and three, coming straight back up. That is another rep got a little fit tip for you the difference between an eccentric movement and a concentric movement when it comes to like a leg day for example so eccentric means that you're lengthening the muscle with force driven against it and concentric means that you're shortening the muscle with force driven against it give the hamstrings here while they're lengthening as the eccentric movement you're fighting that force that's pulling you down to lift the weight back up something similar to this would be the shortened position or the concentric movement of doing a lying hamstring curl love giving love to the muscles in different lengthened and shortened positions but we're going to get ready to demolish ourselves because we're going to be roasted, toasted, and ghosted after this, especially the glutes and hamstrings because we're doing <gasps> Bulgarian split squats. I'm so sorry. Promise it's not too bad after this, but we have three sets of eight glute dominant Bulgarian split squats. So the difference here from a regular Bulgarian split squat is that you're going to hinge forward just a little bit. So you really target that glute on your movement up and down. Slight hinge. And when you're really sitting into the glute dominant Bulgarian split squat, you'll feel the difference between doing a typical or more quad focus Bulgarian split squat because with those your torso is a little bit more upright but it's okay we're done with these and we're moving on to some hamstring curls next up we have a lying hamstring curl three by eight of these the thing is I don't actually have a lying hamstring curl machine so I'm always going to make do with what I have this one here is more of a Nordic hamstring curl but the thing is we're still working that hamstring in the shortened position if you don't have a specific piece of equipment, don't sweat it. You can always make do with what you have, whether that is just doing a lying hamstring curl with a BOSU ball or using sliders, you can make it to what works for you. Okay guys, and that is the end of my week eight, day one of my lift program. Always going to make sure that I foam roll and really stretch after and focus on doing some static stretches just to hold a position and let my body know that it's time to cool down. I absolutely love being able to share my workouts with you guys, whether that's just me in the gym, not pose, not flexing, anything like that. It's just an organic way of sharing what my workouts look like, but I think it's also a lot less daunting to be able to see just one day of workouts rather than an entire week. So let me know if you guys enjoyed this. We made it through week eight, day one. Jack passed away. JJ, he made it through because he's conditioned for this stuff. I passed away. Oh, he passed away. <laughs> oh, you passed away. Okay. Next, we're going to another gym in our area that has like saunas and cold plunges and all the other things that this one doesn't because it's private. We want to we want to sauna and steam room it up. JJ made a whole friend at the gym in the sauna, cool. and we got memberships, so we'll be back strictly for the sauna. But I'll be back for the weights because they have leg day equipment I'll be and everything. Back for the dance class. Yeah, the dance class was going on too. They were loving that. Now we're gonna find some food because it's been a long day, a long periodically time. Welcome back to where I spend the majority of my time. I have all my goodies here. My phone's plugged in, iPad is ready to go. Got the Apple Pencil. I'm at my computer, it's time to edit. This is where I spend so much time, you guys, but it's kind of my happy place. I take calls here, I'll sit on FaceTime with my friends. We got food, and I feel like I've taken you with me throughout my day. Honestly, the gym was like the biggest thing, and then we went to the second gym, which we did end up signing up for just because we really wanted, I really wanted more equipment, which I kept my first gym membership. Don't think that I left that one, love them to death. But I wanted somewhere that had a little bit more stuff, and also this place has all kinds of other things going on, and then just more leg day equipment, which was lacking at the previous gym, but it's more like a strength and conditioning facility. This is a really good start to May. I just contacted my giveaway when 
winners sent them a nice little Venmo just for you know supporting me and everything and if you guys didn't know you guys can always send me your email order confirmation just forward it to me at Libby Christensen with two n's at gmail.com and that automatically enters you into my giveaway whether you use my link or code but I also do giveaways where it's not monetary based where you don't have to do that I know that gift cards are fun and we love a good little surprise gift or something like that but we are all living real life and I know that bills need to be paid so I like to give back to you guys just in a simple way like that but if you guys have anything else that you want to see I love being able to take you guys through today's workout it was week eight day one which was the same as week seven day one since the lift program is a four-phase training system you have two weeks of the same workouts you're working on progressive overload you'll get another two weeks of workouts so it's really fun because you kind of get used to it you have like the first week where you're getting acclimated and then the second week you really hit it hard i'm in editing mode i feel like i haven't been in a hot minute i'll talk to you guys in a little bit <laughs> 